Ah, you're back. Interesting. Excuse me a moment. You've heard, I suppose, that there's been an adjustment. It's a one door closes, another opens sort of thing. Yes, the story's been told, but the truth of that story isn't fixed. Far from it. You told from a uh, different perspective. A chance to turn back the clock, walk in different shoes, make fresh choices. Perhaps take a few risks this time. Raise a little hell. Think we got enough? If we run out, we can always call for backup. So, uh, look. I've never been down there before. Down? The water. Diving. Or maybe you could show me how the pros do it. Dude, of course. Yeah? I'm like practically a dive master, man. But I gotta tell you, I'm tough. Exactly what I say. So I gotta do what you tell yep. me? Yep. So you're like my boss? Kinda, yeah. You gonna pay me? <laughs> Whoa, careful. That dive cam is like super expensive. Well, bro, be cool. What? Julia and Conrad are, you know, how do I say it? Super fucking loaded? So? So don't sweat the little stuff, man. It's not cool. Don't make me regret letting you tag along. Dude, you know I'm not like the best around new people. Whatever. Gotta shut up. Brad, you're not on this trip because you're my bro. I mean, you are my brother, but I mean, like, we're buddies, you know? Um, kinda. We're just out here to fucking hang, cool out, and kick it. What the fuck are you talking about? Let's just kick it and be legends, man. 
All right, amigo. Calvary's almost here. Cool. Sorry I'm a little snappy. I'm just... We knew medical school would be stressful, you know? Total shocker. And man, the long distance thing with Julia, it's been rough. Yeah, I got you. It must be tough. No worries, man. Huh? <laughs> yep. Right on cue. What? Conrad doesn't think we have enough beer. Ah. I guess I keep these in an undisclosed location. Yeah. Hey! So, uh, can I get your input on something? Yeah, what? Just, uh, about. About finishing med school? No, but it's just kind of a big life choice, you know? I don't know what's the right thing to do. Go with your gut. If it's right, you'll know. Hey! <clears throat> oh, <laughs> sorry. Connie, this is Alex. Hey, what's up, man? Conrad. <laughs> Watch it, sis. Lady killer, right here. <laughs> Good to finally meet you, comrade. This is Brad, by the way, my little bro. Hey. Bradley! I feel like I already know you. I've heard so much about you. Yeah, uh, likewise. Miss me? Wanna crack the cold one with you? Every second. <laughs> uh, that's a lot of seconds, cowboy. I mean, I would have gone with minutes. Way less needy. <laughs> So, first dive, you and me? I... If you can keep up this time. Yeah, of course. The whole reason we're out here is to spend time together. Well, I think it'll be perfect. Where's the old crust bucket skipper anyhow? I'd invite you to make yourselves at home, but, uh... So is everybody on board and ready to go? Said, get it all out. Uh, yeah. You uh, want to go lie down? Yeah. You know, maybe I should. Oh boy. Let's see those hot picks. What about over here? That's pretty far out of the way. I'm just thinking about backup targets in case we don't find anything on the dive cam. Listen, to be honest, I've never heard of this wreck you're looking for. Usually these things are crawling. Well, hot diggity dong. Alex, come here. I think we got something. Nice dive. I'm so sure it would be here. Yeah, I mean, what are the odds we're really going to find a needle in a haystack? I'm going to go help Conrad and Julia with the camera. What you got? Feast your eyes on this. Brad's calculations were right on the money. Always bet on Brad. Yeah, kid's a whiz. We should thank him. Bliss, we found a plane. Yeah? Yeah, looks like World War II. We are ready to dive. Uh, technically, we should call this in to port authorities as an unreported wreck. Well, technically. Are you sure you don't want to do this the right way? Wait, are you saying we shouldn't dive?
the right way. Come on, what is this, kindergarten? I had to bring it up. If we just go down and take a look, who's gonna know? Fine, as long as you're quick. And don't touch anything. I just can't wait to be the first one down there. Can you imagine, untouched? We should be ready to get you guys in the water in a few. I'll set up the tanks. The boys will do the final checks. Take a look at the camera, see if you can find anything useful. Righto. Hey, maybe you should check on your bro. Hey, sis. Mm-hmm. Oh, Captain, my Captain. You know, we have rules out here for a reason. You guys gotta respect that. Ah, oh, yeah. Sorry about that. My sis can be a little, uh, intense. Yeah, that's one way to put it. There are laws here and customs. You gotta respect that. These rules are all pretty basic stuff. How much experience do you have with these kind of dives? Oh, I got experience. In all the right places, if you catch me. Yeah, I caught it. And I tossed it back. You don't seem to give up easily, do you? For all you know, this could be a war grave. Disturbing it would be illegal and immoral. You know, you're even more intoxicating when you're angry. Spoken to a woman before in your life, have you? No. Hmm. It shows. I think this might be bogus. Well, hello. What's this? How you feeling? I shouldn't have had that beer. No sweat, Braddy Shack. We'd be hanging up top. Should you care to join? <laughs> yeah, I'll be up as soon as I <clears throat> stop puke heaving. Wow, I can't unhear that term. One, why are you acting so weird? And two, why are you offering to help for like the first time ever in your life? Look, I was just thinking it might make a good first impression on the lovely Fliss. Okay, now three, don't call her the, she's a person, not a thing. And four, do you ever even think about anything else? Hey, lady's got a thirst and I'm here to quench it. And what's with all the numbers? Oh yeah, I forgot. Bro's afraid of math and that's five. Gotta say, not too happy with our captain at the moment. Hey, she's all right. She's just a bit of a stickler for the rules. The word is bitch. Hey, look, she's not gonna be down there with you. She can't stop you from doing shit. Connie, you gotta keep it in your pants around Fliss. Just cool it with all your desperate pickup bullshit. Uh, desperate? Look, I could charm the fish from the sea, sister. Just you wait. All right, I'm gonna get these rebreathers set up and then we'll go through the final steps together. Great, 
I'm gonna kick back and uh, enjoy the sights for a little while. And by enjoy the sights, I mean I'm gonna ogle our captain like a grade A creep. Yeah, I got it. Gross. Hey, at least I'm honest. Still gross. Hey. Hey, back. Hey, guys. Tanks are ready. Tanks a lot. Okay, so this is the rebreather. Way cooler than a regular scuba setup. It takes all that CO2 that you'd normally just exhale into the water, and instead, it gets totally reused. Then it reduces decompression time on your way up. State of the art. Okay, O2 check done. Whoa, 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 eager beaver, you gotta check your O2 first. Looking good, Jay. I'd like to take you underwater. Hey, that's my sis you're talking about. You know it. Oh, hey, guys. What, Jesus, why are you so loud? I almost completely forgot. When I was looking at the dive cam, I saw this huge hole in the tail, kablooey. That's your way into the plane. Oh. Nice work, man. Thanks, Conrad. Okay, you little clown fishes. I'm gonna go see what Fliss is up to. You behave, Connie. How's it going? Are those two going in or what? Any minute now. All right, kids. Good to go. Just remember the rules, please. This is so tight. She acts like we're going to ransack the plane. Hey, a souvenir would be cool. It's not like one tiny little thing would hurt anybody. I won't tell if you won't. <laughs> it's not like we can scan the wreck every night at sundown. There. That shape. That's gotta be it. Whoa. That is, like, way bigger than I thought. Damn. It's pretty intact, too. This is a fucking remarkable find, but it... The turret! We can get in through there. Dangerous. Uh, ladies first? <laughs> Can I just take a second to say, holy shit, Alex, we did it. I mean, can you believe it? It's a dream come true. <laughs> Let's not waste any time not exploring. Go, go, go! <sighs>
Julia, leave it. You'd have to take your gear off to get in there. Not worth it. That pipe's pretty tight. What if you get stuck without your rebreather? Maybe it is kind of dangerous. Bullet holes all down the fuselage. Brad's gonna flip when he sees this. Check it out. They reconfigured the bomb rack to hold lifeboats. Interesting. One of the rescue boats is missing. Think they were using it? Let's see what else we can find. Good God. holding something. Wow. What the hell happened here? In the look of things, they knew they were goners. He's holding something. Hear that? Let's check it out. Want to go first? <clears throat> ah, cheap piece of shit. Pilot and co-pilot. Gotta be. Plane crash not high on my list of ways to perish. Easy now. This stuff's been down here a long time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. holding something. Howdy, Captain. You fancy a pint with your second in command? You are not my second in command. Third in command? No. Fresh in your cabin, boy. Still a no. Your well paying, dashingly handsome, seafaring client is requesting the pleasure of your company over a frosty amber liquid. Sure. 
Why not? Pretty nice ride you got here. Where'd you get the cash? It's a long story. It's complicated and it's really several trips to the bank and signing of big stacks of paper with large numbers on them. So you took out a loan? You know, you're smarter than you look. If you're interested, maybe my family can make an investment in your business. That's very kind of you to offer. I suppose we could have that conversation. Uh, you know what? I better spend some time keeping the Duke of Milan ship shape. Aye, aye. Weather looks clear. Why do I keep these around? How's it going? Knocked out by cold frosty. Man, I feel like such a wimp. Hey, it's your vacation. You're allowed to overdo it. I am officially starting a temperance club. Party of one. Lifetime membership. Hope the lovebirds are having the time of their lives down there. I hope they know what they're doing down there. Attitude matters 20 meters down. Certification. What other dyes have they done? When I got the booking, I thought they were newbies. Alex and Julia have both logged plenty of dives. I'm the real amateur, but I'm ready. Huh. Gotta get back up top. Check you later. Duke of Milan, 20 miles north of the coast, over. Reading you, how can we help, over? Looking for a weather report in my area, over. Got a severe front heading into your vicinity from northwest. Thunder, lightning, 21 knot winds. Keep an eye on that. We'll check you in the AM rounds, over. Appreciate the heads up, but we got this under control, over.
Hey there, how's it hanging? Of your relaxation time. I'm a man of many talents. It's too bad charm is not among them. Ah, but my charm is like a boomerang. You think it's gone right over your head until smack, you're out cold. That makes no sense. I have to keep track of the dive, but I'd be happy to continue this conversation later when I can give you my full attention. What's that about? Fishing boat, from the looks of it. How should we handle this? Uh, we? are not doing anything. I'm the captain, so you be quiet and let me handle it. You got that? Guys, you gotta keep back, we've got divers in the water. Damage here, you see this? Look at our boat. We can take care of this, man. It's not a problem. What do you think? Like uh, ten bucks cover it? <laughs> Whoops, my bad. Let's make it twenty. I can do thirty. All right, you guys drive a hard bargain, but I'm with you. Here, let's just throw in the whole pot. Let's go. No! I guess they didn't need the money. <laughs> the only thing funnier than watching you try to buy your way out of that situation is seeing your money go to waste. I got a smile out of you. Worth every penny. You're a piece of work, Conrad. I'm not all work, I'm a little play, too. Are you trying to flirt with me? Is it working? I don't even know what it is. Well... When you think of something, I'll just be over here taking in the view, flirting up a storm. Hashtag wink. Okay, I think they're on their way back up. And I was getting used to it just being you and me. We need to light the grill. Oh, oh, pick me, pick me. You can call me Grill Capitan. You may light the grill, but I will never call you that. This is my fault. My boat, my fault. Hey, what the hell is going on? Uh, hey, JJ, don't worry about it. Oh, nothing. Your brother just took it upon himself to blow up my grill. Conrad, what is wrong with you? What was up with that other boat? These fishing guys came by and ran into the dive line. Whatever. Who cares, right? What I want to know is, what'd you guys find? Well, we found the plane, and it is huge, full of cool stuff. Oh my god, you guys, can you all just shut up for like one second? <laughs> Holy shit! Dude, bro, congrats! Nicely done. Come up and let's celebrate. <laughs> You're getting to know these intrepid adventurers then. Alex and his little brother Brad, trying to swim with the big fish, both seem 
out of their depth. And Julia, the love of Alex's life, and he the love of hers. Fellow, you might say, or maybe you'd say arrogant. And then there's Captain Fliss, strong, forthright, stubborn. Do I detect a spark between her and Conrad? Let me reassure you, you help them to make some decisions they'll value later on. And some I think they may regret. <laughs>